I'm David Toman, author of NootropicsExpert.com, and in this video I'm going to share with you what I know about Pramiracetam as a nootropic, what it is, why we use it, the science behind it, dosage, and side effects. Pramiracetam is one of the newer nootropics in the Racetam family. Pramiracetam was developed by Park Davis in the late 1970s from Pyracetam, substituting an amide group. Park Davis was once America's largest and oldest drug maker. It has since been acquired by Pfizer, a part of their acquisition of Warner Lambert in 2000. Park Davis has an interesting history and were pioneers in many areas including drugs that affect cognition, even conducting some research with peyote in the early 1900s. Pramiracetam it, as a nootropic is legal and sold in many parts of the world as a prescription drug. Pramistar, Premier, and or Remen. In the United States, Pramiracetam is sold as an over-the-counter research compound and is readily available to the nootropics community. Pramiracetam shares a unique quality with Coloracetam, which I did a video earlier in this series in the Racetam class in nootropics. Its primary method of action is boosting high affinity choline uptake in the hippocampus. It helps increase acetylcholine synthesis and a function which helps overall cognition, improve memory and recall, learning and focus. Pramiracetam has been shown in the lab to not directly influence GABA, dopamine, norepinephrine or serotonin in the brain. So don't look to Pramiracetam to uh, correct mood and anxiety issues. Pramiracetam does increase nitric oxide activity in your brain, helping to increase cerebral circulation, which improves the efficiency of brain cells needed for motor function, learning, and visual function. Well, first, Pramiracetam improves memory. Several, several animal and human studies show that Pramiracetam has a significant impact on memory. In this animal study, researchers administered Pramiracetam to rats in a one trial test. Now this is significant because it proves that Pramiracetam works right out of the gate. It doesn't take multiple doses or a couple of weeks to build up in your system. It works on the first day you use it. The scientists found that the rats had significant improvement in retention by using Pramiracetam and the effect lasted for 24 hours. And second, Pramiracetam increases high affinity choline uptake. Studies have shown that Pramiracetam boosts HACU in the hippocampus. The increase in acetylcholine makes more of this neurotransmitter available to neurons for cognitive processing increasing attention, mental clarity, memory, and verbal skills. High affinity choline uptake is the uptake of choline in synapses needed for acetylcholine synthesis. This is a critical link in the chain of events needed for you to make acetylcholine. Now studies with Pramiracetam and other racetam nootropics like Coloracetam show that boosting uh, high affinity choline uptake increases memory and even restores memory function in parts of the brain that have been damaged. Pramiracetam helps boost acetylcholine synthesis and use in your brain and increases cerebral circulation. As a nootropic, Pramiracetam easily crosses a blood-brain barrier and since it is fat soluble, it must be taken with a healthy fat to ensure absorption. Pramiracetam increases the amount and efficiency of acetylcholine by influencing the high affinity choline uptake system in your brain. This increase in acetylcholine can have a profound effect on overall cognition and memory. Now, with Pramiracetam, you'll find it's e it easier to focus and learning ability will improve. This increase in acetylcholine in the hippocampus helps with logic and understanding complex mathematical and technical subjects, if that's your thing. Increased neuroplasticity from more acetylcholine and improved cerebral circulation affects long-term potentiation. So you may find it easier to recall long forgotten memories. 
Many neurohackers report that taking pramiracetam quickly gets your brain firing on all cylinders. There is an intense increase in focus and possibly even a boost in confidence. But once you get accustomed to the laser-like focus, the novelty wears off and you become used to be, being able to focus at will. Pramiracetam is reported to be great for intense, long study sessions or when you face logical, attention-based tasks where you need sharp focus. Like when you're doing a presentation before the board or a group of VCs. Now this nootropic makes burning through tedious, arduous tasks that require a level of sustained focus easier and that otherwise would seem difficult. Others report improved a recall ability, fluidity of thought, and ease of verbal communication and number calculations. The research on pramiracetam is fairly extensive because it's been around for a while. I've got extensive studies, clinical studies, that you can check out on Nootropics Expert in the original transcript of this video. So just go to Nootropics Expert and search for pramiracetam or click on the link below this video. I've got a clinical study on how pramiracetam normalizes uh, brain waves. I've got another clinical study on how pramiracetam improves memory. And I've got another study on how pramiracetam enhances cognition. Recommended pramiracetam dosage is 250 to 400 milligrams up to three times per day. One pramiracetam dose in the morning, one in the early afternoon, and if you're doing a third dose, do it later in the afternoon. Pramiracetam is fat soluble, so for best results, take it with a quality fat like unrefined coconut oil or MCT oil or olive oil. If you don't take pramiracetam with supplemental fat, don't expect it to work very well. Pramiracetam is one of the two racetams, the other one is coloracetam, that has a profound effect on high affinity choline uptake. This means it will help your brain make more acetylcholine and boost the use of acetylcholine. Acetylcholine is synthesized from available choline in your brain, which means that for best results you should stack pramiracetam with supplemental choline. I recommend a good quality choline source like alpha GPC or CDP choline. And pramiracetam tastes particularly nasty, so you may want to get capsules or tablets rather than powder, unless you're making your own capsules. And do not try to take pramiracetam sublingually because it will literally burn the lining of your mouth. Pramiracetam is non-toxic, so is considered well tolerated and safe. Now, as with many of the racetams, Pramiracetam can cause headaches because it boosts the use of choline in your brain. Choline supplements like alpha-GPC or CDP choline can help you avoid this side effect. Many neurohackers find that taking pramiracetam with a choline supplement boosts the effect with improved memory and cognition, and this is supported in several research studies. Now, some users report that pramiracetam blunts their emotions. Decisions when it comes to life and work issues are logic-based rather than emotional. Now, this can be good or bad depending on the situation, of course. You could call it emotional objectivity. Pramiracetam is sold in tablet, capsule, and powder form. Tablets and capsules are usually 250 to 300 milligrams each. In Europe, pramiracetam is a pres prescription drug under brand names Pramistar, Nupramir, and Remin. So my nootropics expert recommendation for pramiracetam is 250 to 400 milligrams up to three times per day. And that's my report on pramiracetam. If you want to see links to the studies I talked about, go to nootropicsexpert.com and search for pramiracetam, or click on the link below this video. There you'll find a full transcript of this video and you'll find dozens of articles on all the well-known nootropics on Nootropics Expert. Now, if you have any questions or you want to share your experience using Pramiracetam, please use the comment section at the bottom of the post on NootropicsExpert.com. I uh, respond to comments and questions at Nootropics Expert usually the same day. Now, if you want to see more videos on all the best nootropics used today, 
subscribe to this channel before you leave. I'll be putting up new videos on nootropics and optimizing your brain every week. I'm David Toman, author of Nootropics Expert.